بسم اللہ الرحمن الرحیم السلام علیکم لیٹس لرن ان ٹوڈیز ویڈیو اباؤٹ ایس پی ڈی اینڈ ایف بلاک ایلیمنٹس آف پیریوڈک ٹیبل یو ار واچنگ مائی یوٹیوب چینل کیمسٹری ٹیوٹر بیفور گوئنگ ٹو ڈسکس دا ٹاپک لائک سبسکرائب اینڈ پریس دا بیل آئیکن ٹو گیٹ دا اپڈیٹس آف کیمسٹری ٹیوٹر ایچ آر اینڈ ڈونٹ فور گیٹ ٹو شیئر وتھ فرینڈس Periodic table is divided into four blocks. They are determined by the valence electron orbital. Periodic table blocks are sets of elements grouped by their valence electron orbital. The four block names are S block, P block, D block and F block. So let's see why they are known as S, P, D and F block elements. S block elements Those elements in which last electron enters the outermost S subshell are called S block elements. So let's see S block elements in periodic table. As by definition, the S block elements are those elements in which the last electron will enter in the S subshell. So let's see how. So the group 1A and 2A elements are known as S block elements. Let's understand with the help of few examples. I have taken the example of hydrogen. lithium sodium and potassium so you can see here very well that the last electron is coming in the s subshell 1s1 for hydrogen 1s2 2s1 for lithium for sodium you can see it is 3s1 and for potassium it is 4s1 so that's why they are known as s block elements because the last electron is coming in the s subshell p block elements Those elements in which last electron enters the outermost P subshell are called P block elements. P block elements occupy a position from group 3A to group 8A. So group 3A, 4A, 5A, 6A, 7A and 8A elements are known as P block elements. Let's understand with the help of few examples. I have taken the example of boron, carbon, nitrogen oxygen fluorine and neon here you can see the electronic configuration from boron to neon in every element you can see the last electron is coming in the p subshell so that's why they are known as p block elements when we will move to the next period so it will be occupying 3p 4p 5p orbitals respectively d block elements those elements in which last electron enters the outermost d subshell are called d block elements d block elements are transition elements which occupy the subgroup p positions so you can see here all the transition elements are d block elements here i am going to take the example of uh, only one element which is iron So its electronic configuration is 1s2, 2s2, 2p6, 3s2, 3p6, 4s2, and 3d6. So here the six last six electrons are coming in the d subshell. That's why it is known as d block element. We can do for the rest of the elements, but I, in this video I just want to tell you the position of the d block elements in periodic table. F block elements those elements in which last electron enters the outermost F subshell are called F block elements so what are F block elements in the periodic table the lanthanide series and actinide series is known as F block elements in the periodic table i am going to take the example of neodymium which uh, with atomic number 60 so let's see its electronic configuration you can see on your screen this is the electronic configuration of neodymium here this is the 4f subshell with four electron so the way uh, we write the electronic configuration of f block is bit different but here important thing is this that lanthanide series occupy the 4f orbitals in which last electron is coming and in actinide series last electron will be coming in the 5f orbital thank you for watching my video i hope it will be helpful for teachers and students for further interesting chemistry videos stay tuned with chemistry tutor hr